Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome to today's video. All right. So, today we are playing Blocks Roots again. We're going to be getting 10 million money, belly, whatever it's called, part two. Don't forget to like and subscribe, hit the post notification bell, and tell me down in the comments what other videos I should do. Should I keep on doing the series? Should I do something else? Should I do other methods? Speaking of method, today we're going to do another method, which is going to be in C2. So I'm basically doing like each C is like one method or two methods just to like reach it. So last time we did vi the C1, like best one. So now we're doing C2. There's a bunch of different ways for C2. CB scrunting, which gives the most money but takes the most time. Or this method I'm about to show you. So I'm gonna just use dark. And by the way, if there's something wrong with my microphone, don't worry about it. I think it sounds like more high pitched because um, I got a new mic and it's pretty crappy. All right, so if you guys know what I'm talking about, um, where this thing is, then you should be up to date with money grinding. But if you don't, um, then you know, right here. So basically when you spawn in, red building tree, go over here, hit the, okay. But it's gonna usually be three chests right there. Another way, uh, actually let's try Coliseum, you never know. I might lose all of the, like, most all of the money to do right now because like ttk is one sword away yo why does it actually sound good ttk is one sword away that actually sounds really good okay he's not here Let's go to Duke Umar one. We could honestly just see Beast Hunt if I wanted to, like. I'm probably just gonna search up best ways to grind money in C2 other than see Beast Hunting. Oh my god, I forgot that one doesn't, it's not a move ability. He's here? No? All right, let's go to Doc number three. Alright, this is where the next one is, so I believe there's an enemy right here, and if you go right here, we could kill Jeremy. Bring back the old times of me literally grinding seven years of my life doing Jeremy. Good times, good times, good times. Alright, I think I'm just, oh, he is here. Yo, one sec, let's start off the video with a quick 50k, you know? We'll start off the video with a quick 50k right there. Alright, let's do Marine. Uh, you! You! By the way, if you like the new editing, tell me down below. I'm doing it by myself now. Without Mrs. Potato. I fired Mrs. Potato. Sorry, everybody, that like... Mrs. Potato better. Whoa! Wait, when did I equip my Snow White? Yo, Snow White actually looks sick. Yo, wait, what? I didn't even know I had it equipped. Me do not know. Yo, kids about to really kill him. Uh-oh. -uh. I'll kill you before. I'll kill you even before you get a touch on him. All right. He's ma. Let's go, 52K. This is a pretty good way, but like, it's pretty rare to find him. All right, let's go back to the cafe. Let's check the stock actually. I have technically, if I do a few more quests, I technically would have enough to get a Leo. 
when or if it ever goes on stock again. It probably will. But like, yo, would you like to see your aura colors? Enabled Snow White. Yeah, I had Snow White enabled. I don't know what it's talking about, bro. Let's see titles. I got the default unlock automatic. You do not unlock that automatically. Anywho. All right, uh, let's go. I'm gonna go quickly look for some good ways. I'm gonna go look for some good C2 ways. All right, so now I found a video and this is, I'm gonna put the link in the description, but it's basically showing Basically how it works is that you go to the cursed ship, go inside, set your home point, and then you get this chest, and then in each every single room you're gonna find a gold crest which gives you 2k. So that's 16k. Which is a pretty pretty fast method actually. So let's go and do that. By the way, thank you again. Thank you so much to uh Whoever created that video, I cannot find it. I'll put the link in the description, so if you guys want to watch it, you guys can. Yeah. All right, haunted ship. We have to set our home point here. And let's see if this. All right, let's get to let's see, 5.5 mil. All right, so that's 800. Now in each every room is gonna be one. Yup, right there. 3K right there. A Blizzard user is now killing me. Yo. You wanna go? He is trying to do the same strat. Ugh! Get completely beamed on, kid. Don't try killing me. Neither do should you, bro. Like, what the hell? Like, what the hell, bro? All right, and then it just says to server hop. All right, so I got a little bit of, of a, a stride track, side track. Um, what's his name? Shiver spawned, so we're gonna go kill Shiver. Huh, he he gives a lot of money, I think. He's also pretty hard to kill, but it's also been like it's been a long time since I've touched since I've even touched Shiver. So maybe he got easier. For this dark blade. But I like this method honestly. Cause like you could do something like watch something, anything. It's just after a little bit you get used to the chest spawning in. So like yeah, and it's a pretty good method also. This is one of those longer methods because they only give you sixteen thousand. But it, th like the matter of fact how fast it is on getting this sixteen thousand is like Something that you need to keep an eye on because that's a pretty fast method Like I would still say the vice at Riminal one is still faster by a landslide It gives more money if you got double XP, but if you don't got double XP this one's actually better And also if you can't one shot him this one's also way better But the one downside about this one is that you need to be level 1100 or you have to like go all the way out of the map and then die to do it. So that just gave me a 
That just gave me a fifty-three thousand boot dollar boost. So which is way better. All right, guys. So, um, right now, actually, I'm at 5.3 mil, but I actually have to go somewhere. So, I'm gonna do this one more time. Put my thoughts on this method, and then I'll like, s like, stop watching. <laughs> I mean, stop recording. So, I th honestly think it's a pretty good method if you like really, really need money. I wouldn't give it my top recommendations. I still think. If you're in third C, CB something in third C is probably the best. Because, like, come on. Those CBs give a lot. Especially when you get those, like, the ones with, like, threes. Like, you can get a million dollars probably each time just from that. So, I still recommend that. But, like, if you want to just, just make some nice, simple cash, this method is Probably the best way. Or the Vice Ed Riminal that I did in the first part. They're both really good ways, honestly. They both have their ups and downs also. So, yeah. What does a full moon do in this? In What's this C called? C3. I mean, C2. The live, I know, like, actually, yeah, what does it do? Ooh. There's another six, yeah. So, if you have portal, you could honestly teleport and do that. That's also a pretty good way, but that's like an extra 6k. I'm currently missioning to find this dude. Actually, I could just go to the cafe and see if he's even here. Oh. Never mind. Let's see what's on stock. <coughs> oh, stock just restart. Just stock just... Oh, light. Dark ice. I really want to get ice. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Make sure to like and subscribe, by the way. And don't, don't forget to hit that notification bell. Now. Peace.